The Gander RV 400 NASCAR Monster Energy Cup Series race is July 28th at Pocono Raceway. Kyle Busch won the Pocono 400 back in the beginning of June, and I spoke with Dino Alberto recently about his takeaways from the first Monster Energy Cup Series race of the summer at the Tricky Triangle. I think my biggest takeaway was after the race was over when um, <clears throat> we were in the uh, press room and the first question came up about the new aero package. They were hoping it was going to be a little more competitive. Unfortunately, it wasn't. You didn't see a whole lot of that uh, at a track like Pocono. So um, one of the media personnel up there asked the question. He answered it. About the second uh, um, individual was about to ask the same question, and Kyle uh, abruptly stopped him in his tracks and said one more question about that, press conference over. So uh, that kind of changed the tone of everything there. But uh, he's Kyle Busch. He wins a lot, and I guess he can do those kind of things. But uh, it was a dominating performance for him. And I think all, all in all, uh, the way Pocono does things, they had a successful weekend because they really uh, uh, hit the ground running when it comes to promoting their shows. So NASCAR's rules now allow air ducts for airflow to the brakes on the cars at Pocono. Dino Alberto joins me this week on Community NEPA News, and we talk with two drivers, father and son, Eric and Austin Beer. So watch our sister show, Community NEPA News.